Eye on Sun Valley's Athlete of the Week is brought to you by State Farm Insurance, Patrick Buchanan, Agent. Sun Valley Associates is the key to your home, a tradition of excellence since 1962. Put our team to work for you, 208-622-4100, svassociates.com. I'm Michael David with High on Sun Valley Sports, and I'm so pleased to be joined by our Athlete of the Week, Sun Valley Ski Education Foundation snowboarder and Wood River High School Wolverine soccer standout Peyton Baca. Peyton, thanks for being with us. Hey, anytime. Congratulations on that. Uh, so you were chosen as our Athlete of the Week based on your recent snowboard accomplishments, uh, most notably representing the United States at the FIS Junior World Championships in the Czech Republic. Uh, yeah. What was that experience like going over there and competing against the best snowboarders in the world? Um, it was really crazy. I got the invite three weeks before, so it was kind of a rush to get a passport and all that. Right. Um, and I flew there by myself, so an international flight was a new thing for me. I'd oh, never wow, been out right? of the country. So I got over there, and I'd, knew, I'd known some of the girls that I'd been competing with just right. on the U.S. team. And so we got there, and there was so much just like anticipation and so much excitement to ride. Right. And then we got on the course, and the course was so much fun. Like, it was one of the best courses I've been on. Oh, cool. Yeah, and so that was just such a fun experience and like racing all of those girls and like being able to get into heats with them is just like I it was so crazy and fun right yeah. right and there's the whole experience you're almost in like an Olympic village with all those other uh, riders yeah. right we were in um, Klinovec which was the resort right. um, and it's right on the border between Germany and the Czech Republic so a lot of the team was staying in Germany right. not the Czech Republic but we were in check and but we got to see everyone every day every Fine. night and hang out with all the different teams well that's great well yeah. uh, congratulations on that Thank accomplishment you. how cool so uh snowboard cross that it, it is a exciting discipline of snowboarding <laughs> yeah. for uh, anyone that hasn't seen snowboarding uh, snowboard cross you got to check it out uh for those that haven't seen it kind of explain what goes on in a race so it goes from either like four to six girls in a heat mm -hmm. Um, usually, you'll spend the first day there racing by yourself and just getting a time okay. to qualify into heats, and then they'll they'll seed you into heats. Right. And so it'll be four girls, and you will just race down. And there's berms, jumps, rollers, and just a bunch of different features. Right, right. I mean, it is a it, it's a gnarly competition. You yeah, know? it is. How do you build up? How do you develop the nerve to? throw yourself down the hill with your competitors all being bunched up, everybody battling for the front of the pack. Yeah, you just have to be confident is what I just try to be. Yeah. And um, <laughs> if you get out front, then there's nobody you have to right. deal with. So that's always my goal. But um, you know they're, they're, yeah, no, you know you know they're, they're behind, behind you, you, bearing down. And mistakes can always um, mess you up and get you into situations like collisions. But you just got to go out there and ride your best and right. try and stay on your line and well, finish. Well, that, that's, so, that's so great, exciting. Um, you've got snow sports in your DNA, you know, with your dad's yeah. background and everything. How did you get into snowboarding, and, and in particular, snowboard cross? Um, well, I used to be a ski racer, mm -hmm. and I just, I never really liked ski racing as a whole. I loved to ski, so I, my dad works for the U.S. snowboard team, so I tried out snowboarding, yeah. and then he got a job um, with the U.S. Snowboard Cross, and I had just grown up watching it, and one of my idols, um, Lindsay Jacob Ellis, had just always told me to just try it, like it'll be fun, but I'd right. always been so scared, and I finally did it, and I was so in love with just like Snowboard Cross as a whole, and just like the feeling of racing with people. Right, right. Yeah. Well, it, it shows in your in the success that you've had. Uh, your your little sister Zoe, she's a she's an accomplished snowboarder too. Are you yeah. guys pushing each other all the time? <laughs> yeah, she um, was national champion last year for USASA nationals, and so that kind of just has boosted her confidence this year. Right. So she's been riding really well, and we've just been pushing each other and having really fun times racing each other. That's great. Yeah. So uh, spring is kind of upon us, but I know your season isn't over yet. What what's ahead? for you in snowboard cross this, this I season? I have USASA Nationals in Copper Mountain, Colorado in 
three weeks, I think. Okay. So that'll be our final event of the season. So on top of all this snowboarding, you are also a stalker standout for the Wood River Wolverines, starting for two years on the varsity team. You play for the Idaho ODP team. How do you balance snowboarding and soccer and your schoolwork and, and a social life? I have really great teachers at Wood River High School, and they allow me to do my school on the road right. while I'm traveling. And I find time when I'm home they help me as well. Right, right. Yeah. You've got training and, and yeah. everything. You just Well, when I go to Boise, I have to do my schoolwork in the car. Right, so right. So I just have to buckle down and get it done. Yep, yep. Yeah. Well, that, you know, you've mentioned having fun and, uh, a couple times, and I think uh, it sounds like that's what you're doing, and that's a pro you know, your success is a product of that. So yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's awesome. Well, thank, thank you. you so much for being here. You're welcome. Our gu my guest has been Peyton Bach, our Athlete of the Week from Wood River High School and the Sun Valley Ski Education Foundation. I want to thank our sponsors, Patrick Buchanan from State Farm Insurance and Sun Valley Associates, a tradition of excellence since 1962. I'm Michael David with Eye on Sun Valley Sports, keeping my eye on Wood River Valley Sports and Wood River Valley Snowboarders for you. Whether you're looking for a new home or the perfect location for your business in the Wood River Valley, John Allen Partners is the key to finding it. John A. Sofro, Principal Broker, Commercial and Residential Specialists, 208-726-3411, johnallenpartners.com. Thank you everyone for joining us today on this week's edition of Eye on Sun Valley, Sun Valley Live. We want to thank our sponsors and my fabulous co-host here, Michael David. Thank you, sir. Oh, my pleasure. This is going to be a fabulous week. The Sun Valley Film Festival is in town and in full swing right now. Yes, and we'll also be uh, keeping our eye on the USSA Freestyle Championship Absolutely. sponsored by Atkinson's this weekend, the 16th through the 19th. Some great aerials and all kinds of fun competition. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a great week in Sun Valley, followed by Dent, of course. Thank you, everyone. Eye on Sun Valley, daily local news from beautiful Sun Valley, Idaho.